This video will discuss how to search for resources using LexisNexis Academic. LexisNexis Academic is a database that provides online access to newspaper articles, legal materials, and broadcast transcripts from regional, national, and international sources. Let's start by going to the library website. On the library homepage, we can click on the databases link to access the databases that the library subscribes to. To find LexisNexis, we can click on the letter L to display all databases that begin with that letter. We can also type in LexisNexis in the search box to find it. You can use the basic search in LexisNexis, just like you would if you were using Google to find resources. So, if we wanted to search for resources relating to student debt, we could type student debt in the search box. There is also the advanced search, which allows you to have more control over what the search does. You can limit the search to a certain date range, you can limit the types of resources that show up in your search, and you can also use the Build Your Own Segment feature to further customize your search. For this example, I'm going to limit my search to resources that were published in the past two years. I'm also going to limit my results to newspaper articles that have the term student debt in the headline. In this example, since I'm searching for articles that have the term student debt in the headline, I can be confident that the results will be relevant. Within the search results screen, you can change how the results are displayed, how they are sorted, and what language they appear in. You can also choose to display results that are in a certain format, like newspapers, magazines, or newsletters. In addition, you can limit your results by subject, publication, or geographic area. For this example, I'm going to click on the plus sign next to the newspapers category and filter my results to only those from the New York Times. To view an article or resource, simply click on its name. Using the icons in the top right, you can choose to print, email, or download the article. You can also export the article citation into a citation manager like RefWorks. If you have any questions, or require any assistance while conducting your research, please visit Ask a Librarian.